First time I saw the Black Hill Silver paint come in, first thing I need to do is go get my sunglasses. You're getting the advantage of a well-engineered, well-designed, tested motorcycle, but all of the extras, all of that hand stuff that makes it a custom, makes it special, and the work that's done, you can't replicate it. It's hand sprayed. You've got a small, tight-knit family of workers in this place, which makes it just really easy to put out a quality product. I paint everything as if it was my own. I do not want to send something out the door that I would not put on my bike. I treat every piece of this bike as this part of me. The hand painting process for this bike, and especially with the marbling being so unique and different every single time, it really kind of adds to this bike being really special. There aren't gonna be two bikes that are exactly the same. You can have two Black Hills Silver Chieftain Elites sitting next to each other and they won't exactly look the same. It's a fingerprint. Each one is gonna be a little bit different. There's a lot of pride that comes with working for Indian Motorcycles. We keep the craftsmanship component of it, but are also able to weave in the process controls and the modern technology of manufacturing today. The flake that we spray on the Black Hills Cheap and Elite is huge. It's the largest flake that we've ever sprayed. The gun that we have to spray it out of, more or less a fire hose. The Black Hills Silver Paint takes us back to the heritage of the gold and silver mines in the Black Hills. It was the mining root of this community. Um, silver, gold, um, precious metals during World War II, tungsten, things the military needed were all mined out of this area. They paid a, a tribute to this shop here when they named that bike Black Hills Silver really stands up to, hey, this bike is painted in the Black Hills, South Dakota. This paint job is gonna be one of the best things that we have, or at the absolute elite level paint job. That's what comes out of this shop. When you ride down the road, you're gonna be noticed. And an Indian motorcycle sticks out. There's something special. This bike is gonna stick out a mile away. It will look like somebody turned a spotlight on that bike. To me, a bike is your vehicle to see the world. There's no better way to see it.